In this tutorial, I want to show you how to create color fade effects or fade out effects or in general color transitions in Show Editor. So first of all, let's draw a line consisting of three different elements. So what I want to do is here I start the line in white, another point here, and I do it here and here. So it's symmetrical. What I want to do is I want to have these lines fade out to black so it's a nice line with fading ends on both sides. So what I did, I drew the line in white and um, what I have to do now is I need to select the points I want to deal with. But first of all, I need to draw one of these points in black. So I select black and I recolor that point to black. And on the other end, I do that as well. So this one will be recolored to black as well. So what you see is this is a black point, this is a black point, and I select both points. On this end, I select Edit, Insert Color Gradient. Then I can give a number of points to be drawn. Um, I, would, I would say, yeah, leave it, leave it with 500 just to see what happens. And you see several points have been inserted and you have a smooth color gradient. We do the same thing on the other side. Both points are selected. I select insert color gradient. I leave that value. Bam, and I have the color gradient inserted. So this is basically a line with two fade out ends. Let's have a look at the simulation. You can perfectly see that in the simulation you have these fine fade out effects. This is it. So it is that easy. You can even preview it in your drawing window if you just um, unmark the points and we remove the grid so you can simply see how it looks like. And this is our line with a fade out ends. It is that simple. Let me show you how to create an object with um, fade effects inside that object with show editor. First of all, we create a new figure. In our case, this is a square. So we just draw a square. We activate the point so we see what we're drawing with and we recolor let's say one of the points here so let's recolor that point for example so only one point is recolored now let's make a smooth color transition here I select this so these two points are selected a red and a white one insert color gradient I leave that and I select more two other two points. So in this case, I need to be a bit more careful because I already entered a gradient down here. So selecting these points is a bit more distinctive. I just... Now we only have these two points, the ones we want to have. And I insert color gradient leave that and what you see is we have a square with a color gradient at one of the corners see that very nice and very easy to do